Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can use Canva to remove the background from images. You can do this with images of people, animals, or any object. So let's go ahead and get started. You can go into your Canva account and pick any design size you wanna use. For this example, we'll use a Twitter post, but again, we can do this with any size design. Doesn't matter what size you pick. You can even do a custom size if you want. So here you're gonna be asked to pick a template, but we're not gonna pick a template for what we're doing here. What we're gonna do is go into the photos that I've uploaded. By the way, you can also do this with photos that you find through Canva's photo search, but I'm gonna use photos that I've uploaded. And let's go down and find a picture that I wanna remove the background from. So let's say I wanna use this picture of my daughter and myself at the airport. Okay. So I wanna use that one. I'm gonna drag it in. Now it's full screen. Highlight the image once. So just click on it once to highlight it. Hit the effects button and remove the background. So we click the background remover. This will automatically remove all things that are in the background of this picture and leave us with just myself and my daughter in the picture. Now, if I go to save this right now, I'll just call this one waiting at airport. So if I go to use this one right now and I want to download it, I'll download it as a PNG. It's going to download it with the white background that we see here. There's nothing inherently wrong with that, except that it may limit the places that we can use it in. So if I go and upload it to my gallery of images, we'll see when it's uploaded that it's going to have that white background. Alternatively, what I can do when I go to download it is I'll download again as a PNG and I'll select transparent background. So now I'll download it with a transparent background. It's gonna have us cut out without any of that white background around it. So let's upload this one. And we'll see the difference here. So now there's no white background around us. And we can drop it in into any other design we wanna use. Now, as I mentioned, this will work with just about any picture you have where there's a clear focal point clear object as a focal point of the image. So for example, if I scroll down here in my gallery of uploaded images, you'll see that I have a picture with my dog in it. Uh, let's go down here and find that picture with my dog in it. There's one. So there's a picture with my dog in it. Let's drag it in. And again, we can go in and use that effect of background remover. It's gonna cut out the background around him, just like it did with people. And there he is, just a white background. That's my dog, Mason. Now, let's try it with one other image, just so you can see how it may work. So I have an image here with a giraffe. Just drag that in, there's that giraffe image, Let's hit the effects, hit background remover. So remove that background, and this one I'm gonna use as a transparent background when it gets cut out. So now, let's go in. Download that as PNG, with transparent background. And now I'm gonna have this kind of standalone giraffe that I can use in other designs. So let me upload that over here in my uploads folder. Drag it in. We're going to have our giraffe, just a plain blank background, transparent background around it. Now let's go in, delete that, pick a template we want to work with. Maybe we want to work with you know, a nice simple template like this one here. We're going to replace the picture of that woman with the picture of the giraffe. There's our giraffe. 
now in that image. So there's our giraffe, and of course we shrink it around, click and drag to make the giraffe bigger or smaller, and customize anything else. So that's how you can remove the background from any image in Canva and use it in other designs. Now I should point out that this is a premium feature or a, or a pro feature of Canva, but as a reminder for teachers, you can get Canva for education for free and that will give you access to all of the pro features of Canva for you and your students. Go to canva.com slash education and use your school issued email address to sign up for Canva for Education and get all the pro features for you and your students for free. Now you may be wondering, is Richard getting paid to say this? No, I'm not. I just like the tool, really think it's great, and so I want to point it out for everyone. And as always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out free tech for teachers.com and practical ed tech.com or just subscribe to my YouTube channel.